Amav Federation COVID-19 Community Update, 11th August, 2021. English Language Edition with Eamon Raza. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. As we all know, considering the increasing situation of Corona in Australia, the Victorian government has decided to continue the lockdown for metropolitan Victoria. This was announced to continue from 11.59 p.m. on the 9th of August, 2021. However, the restrictions for regional Victoria were eased and the lockdown for the area was concluded. The previous five reasons which allow you to leave your homes are still in place for the metropolitan area. The first of these is necessary groceries for which you are allowed to leave five kilometers from your home considering the fact that only one member of the family can leave once in one day for this task. The second being exercise for which you can leave your home for two hours with another family member also considering the five kilometer rule. The third being for medical care, this includes necessary visits to a medical center, a hospital, or to get tested for corona. The fourth reason being education or for work. This regards those who are not able to gain their education online at home and for those who are not able to conduct their work online or from home. These individuals will be given permission as an authorized worker with a permit to leave their home to work. The fifth and last point, which is also crucial, is to leave the house in order to get the vaccine. For those who are eligible to get the vaccine and are able to get it, are encouraged and given permission to leave the house for that purpose. Please keep in mind that the use of face masks and sanitizers are still just as crucial as they were before and are proved to be helpful. As we all know, a large portion of our community is currently busy in preparing for the arrival of the month of Muharram. The majalis that are to be taking place during the month of Muharram, as you all are aware, will not be occurring in physical gatherings until the 12th of August or until further notice as for the restrictions of this lockdown. So for the time being, the majalis will be taking place on online platforms such as Zoom. For this matter, the MAF Federation has provided a Zoom platform for the members of this community in which the volunteers will provide the ability to book any majalis or any technical facilities or gain any form of technical assistance. After the announcement on the 12th of August, if permission to hold physical gatherings will be given, then another facility from the MAF Federation will be provided to you. This will include free face masks and free hand sanitizers for those entering your households when attending Majalis. Other than this, the two important messages that we all need to be especially careful about are entering COVID exposure sites and getting the vaccine. Exposure sites are where individuals who have tested positive for COVID-19 had visited while they were, were they, while they were possibly infectious and if you have any suspicions that you have been in contact with, with someone who was actively infectious, we urge you to get tested for corona. We also strongly encourage you to get the COVID-19 vaccine to put in the effort to protect yourselves, those you care about, and your community. In the near future, the MAF Federation will be organizing programs in which we will be inviting doctors and important figures from our own community to an online platform for a discussion to answer and put to rest any questions, concerns, or misconceptions members of the community may have. If you have any questions or concerns, please feel free to contact us through our email, which is info.amaf.org.au or contact our volunteers through WhatsApp or messages, and we will try our absolute best to be of help to you. Other than this, if you have any questions or concerns relating to any aspect of corona or this lockdown, the volunteers of the Muff Federation are here to help.